Welcome back to the new save file. We are back once again. Let's see how we go with our randomization. We had a rough time last episode um, of me just failing upwards constantly. Uh, we're going to do Job this time around, apparently. Let's give that a go. I'm liking that we're getting uh, randomizations of our modded characters. I, need to get, I do need to get back to the chat. Ooh, I burped in the middle of that sentence. I apologize. Uh, I do need to get back to the tarnished characters at some point. I will do that soon. Oh, one one issue I'm having right now, and it's an undescribable amount of uncomfortableness. It's not even that bad, but it's just un really uncomfortable, is for some reason, one of my ears needs to pop, and I don't know why. Oh damn, we've only got Mega Satan and Greed to do as this guy, so I guess we've got to really focus hard on doing Mega Satan here then. Um, let's give it a go. But yeah, my ear needs to pop, and I don't know why, and it's really fucking annoying me. Do you know, like when you when you like get the pressure build up, and like it feels like your ear needs to pop? Oh my god! I'm trying my best to pop it. It just ain't working. It just ain't working. Nothing I do changes it, and it's very frustrating. But yeah, I do love a bit of Job. Um, classic character, really, really vanilla style. Uh, just normal character that has good fire rate, and I absolutely love good fire rate because good fire rate synergizes with so many things. Um, tier effects just become way better with more fire rate, stuff like that. It's it's all good, and then his active obviously is quite nice as well here. In fact, it's probably a good room to use this in. Very bad hit by me, but for, to be honest, I didn't expect one of these guys to poo, poo out two pooters. So I was a little bit taken aback by that. Normally you get like one pooter or maybe zero. It's very rare that you get two. That was a little bit annoying, but there you go. God damn, look at this. Oh, really? I've walked myself right into that. Okay, not doing great on the HP front so far. I've been playing just really terribly recently. That's just been my Isaac life at the minute. It's just that for some reason I can't really play the game very well. Uh, we did get money equals power, though, which I'm very, very happy with. Um, we're trying to save as much money as we can. Should be a good way for us to get quite a lot of damage. Good, good, good. It'd be good if we could open this chest right here, actually, because that would uh, give us quite a bit of extra money, potentially. But we're going to need money to open it, so... No, our character looks kind of swag now, also. <laughs> character looking kind of swag. Yeah, today's an interesting day for me because, uh, for one, um, well, today's today's a, a frustrating day um, in general, and so is tomorrow because um, tonight at midnight is when um, when Diablo 4 releases, and it's a game I've been waiting for for 11 years, but I'm not gonna be able to play it at midnight tonight because I have um, I have work in the morning really really early. Um, I've worked, well, I say really, really early. It's not really, really early compared to most people. I have to get up at, like, 7, which to most people is, like, a normal time to get up and go to work. But, because I work at home normally, I start work at 9. I don't have to be up until, like, half 8 or even 9, because I'm in the in the room where I start working. So, sometimes I can get up really late. Um, but this, uh, we've got, like, a, a stream that we're doing tomorrow. And the thing is, it's, like, an all-day thing as well. I was like, ooh... I'll book the day off work, it'll be ace, and I'll play Diablo all day, and then I realised I, I literally can't, there's like something that I'm doing that only I can do, I was like, uh, damn, I can, I, I cannot do that. Oh baby, that's a lot of pennies, thank you muchly. Still a little bit worried about my current HP right now, I might even go and buy a heart if there's one in here. Yeah, it's too, too much of a risk to lose this run. I'd rather lose a tiny bit of damage and actually just buy a heart there. Oh shit. I was very confused by where we were there, but Telepills uh, sent us into that room, didn't it? So we're a bit early to that room. But yeah, so I was I've, I, I had great plans to just book the day off work and play Diablo all day and all weekend. And I can't, and I'm sad. And like, as well, like Friday, it's not even a day that I can finish early either. Like, it's all day. I'm going to be, I'm going to be up at like... I'm going to be starting work at like 8 o'clock, and I'm going to be working and probably until at least 6 or 7 o'clock. And it's like, oh, god damn. It's like a full 12 hour day, and it's like, dude, I never, like, my job, 
like, because I work at home, I never normally work those sort of hours, and it just so happens to be that we've got a live stream to do on that day, and I've got to manage the whole thing, and it's like, ugh, oh, I just want to play Diablo. Ugh, oh, we got this gross guy. We got this gross fella. Don't do your little bonk attack, I don't like it. And your little midges as well. I never remember what you do with this thing. Okay, nothing much, apparently. He's bonking again. Okay, he's into second phase. He's into second phase, at least. Okay. At least second phase, he has lower HP. I just wish his goddamn invincibility phase wasn't 16 years. Okay, and of course, we get the stupid corn item after killing this guy as well, which is... Useless to us. It's all a bit upsetting, really, isn't it? Right, we're trying to do, um... We're trying to do, what's it called, uh... Mega Satan here, so let's try and play it safe. At least a little bit safe. One second. Right, let's keep it going. Try and not get hit, try not lose our devil deal here. Uh, that'd be so funny if I got hit there immediately. This guy's kind of annoying. Stop spewing out so many flies on me, dude. See, I, I kind of hope for Bob's Rotten Head here, but because it's really good, but I really want to keep my book. The book is probably better. Okay, we got a card anyways. Chariot. I don't know when I'd use this, but maybe just in this room, depending on how difficult he... Yeah, do you know what? Just makes this room way less annoying. It wasn't a particularly hard room anyways, but it just solves an issue for me. Okay. Don't need it. This room, like I said, try and keep my devil deal alive if I can. Don't think I'm going to put into the dice room once I get more keys this floor. As for the question of the day today. Hmm. We're playing Isaac. When was the last time that you cried? Mine is, is uh, like, something... I know some, some of you are going to have probably pretty sad answers, so apologies. <laughs> um, but for me, mine was um, actually watching How I Met Your Mother, which is weird. Because, for one, that show is, like, near and dear to me because I watched it as a kid and it's just, I don't know, it's got a special place for me. But also, um, because... In one of the later, uh, like in, in the last season, some uh, two of the characters get married, and the song that plays while they're getting married is Future Days by Pearl Jam, which happens to be the song that Joel from The Last of Us sings in The Last of Us 2, which is also a game that is very dear to me. And I had like this concoction of emotions that culminated in me just sort of bursting out into tears. <laughs> <laughs> I don't often cry at TV and stuff. I'm not that sort of person, really. But this this just got me, because it was like the culmination of two different things. And it was like, oh, God. It's going to happen. I don't know how far away I need to be from this guy. Oh, my God. I really don't like the prospects of this. It's the midges I don't, I don't care for. Oh, shit. Why did I release you? You don't actually explode that far. It's not that bad. Good. Take him out as well. Okay. And we got a soul heart here as well, so we are protected for our devil deal. Oh, dude, two gross bosses in a row. I say we're protected for our devil deal. We're not, really. With this boss, we're not. Because he's a nightmare. He's an absolute nightmare is what he is. He just fills the screen with bullshit. Luckily, we've got good damage output here, so we can kill him pretty quick. But yeah, still a boss that I always find difficult to not get hit against. We'll take that. That's very good. That's even more tears up. Our tears are looking very spicy now. And we will, of course, be going angel deals. We'll try and keep that dream alive. Right. See what we got here straight off the bat. Brownie, and then leaves Brodicle. It's, 
It's weird because it, that, that's really good damage. I'm going to take it because the damage is really good because it's a flat 1.5. But the, the slight chance for you to do the little poop slick thing, it makes you like slide around and it's really frustrating. Oh my god, bad hit. Because, like, okay, so I say the slight chance. It's literally fucking constant. Dude. Such a bad hit, and it was because of the fucking slippies. It just never stops. Like, just calm down, slippies. I don't care for you. I've, I've already massively, massively regretted taking this. Because it's just bullshit. Also, after losing an angel deal, thanks for that. I really like the damage we get, but... Yeah, it's like, it plants a corn mine down, and then puts some poop slick down, but like, it puts the poop slick down for so long, just, just, do it for like a second, and then stop, please. For like a second, and then stop. Ugh, the slidey's got me again! So goddamn frustrating. Ooh, HP, nice. Good, good, good. Right. I'll take this. Could be HP down. Yes, it is. Good, good, good. I knew it. I was like, if I take this pill after getting a HP up, it will be a HP down. But I'm going to test it anyways, and of course it fucking was a HP down. I I can't get out of the way because this slippy shit. Oh my god. Why do I take... Why do I... This item, for me, this item is exactly like, uh, what's it called? Um, guillotine. Every single time I see it, I'm like, no, 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 the damn, the stat up's worth it. I'll take it. The stat up's worth it. It's never worth it. It's never once been worth it. This item is stinky. I really hope we get flight as soon as possible to alleviate this mess, because otherwise I'm going to die because of this item. I've already been hit three times because of it this floor. Nice. Um, this is kind of a tricky one. Do you know? I'm gonna take. I lose obviously a bit of damage from doing that, but I'm gonna take that because I feel like 4.5 volt with a three room charge active is actually pretty good. Slideys, don't do me dirty. I can't fucking. is not worth it. Good, I was hoping for more money, but oh, there you go, a little bit more money. Yeah, we'll lose a bit of uh, damage there, but I think it's worth it. Get out of the sky, you freak. Bomb him. And... Honestly, do we even need to see the rest of this floor at this point? Probably should, but oh well. Oh god. I forgot that he could do this sometimes. It's such a rare attack. But yeah, now sometimes we might be able to use our book twice in one room, which I really like the idea of. At least the corn mines are somewhat useful. Good. And that's actually pretty decent. We'll take that. And I guess I will check the rest of the floor. Uh, this is secret room, right? No, it's not. Okay. It looks very secret roomy to me. Yeah, I guess I'll do the rest of the rooms just in case there's something, something sexy lying in wait. You never know. There could be a planetarium back here that I've got very lucky on. And I'll regret it heavily if I miss that. Good, good. Could get a world card for the next floor. That's also a pretty good pull. Oh, that thing can hit me from there? Okay, I did not realise the, the whippies had that sort of range. And he got me again. He does a full heart of damage? Fuck you. A full heart of damage. What the hell? The Whippy to the full heart of damage. Okay. Uh, that has hurt me significantly more than I would have expected. And this guy's going to give me a heart now, isn't he? While he's over that gap and I can't get to it. I know your games. 
game. Dude, this slidey shit is, oh my god, it's the most frustrating thing in the world. What did I tell you? It's going to give me a heart where I can't access it. Of course it is. Why wouldn't it? I have to go buy a heart. I don't trust myself. There's no heart in here. Doesn't matter then. Good, good. Right. Guess we just gotta go and hope we don't die. No secret room either. Right, let's go. So, I can't believe that whippy guy just oh, full heart of damage. And he was able to reach me at that distance. I didn't think that was in his radius. And also, we no longer have protection for our uh, angel deal here. So, the angel deal might not come as easy as I would have hoped. Realistically, I should be using my, um, my active way more often because of 4.5 volt. But... It's always like too good to use syndrome. I'm always like, what if the next room's better for it? It doubles our money. I'm gonna I'm gonna use this now. I'm gonna hold this until the end of the floor. Puzzle piece is rather nice here. Puzzle piece. I got you. Poop slick, please stop. You. Mad Onion's real good. We don't know what we're getting here, so let's just take this one. Stars. Unfortunately, not what we want. Okay. I think we go through here. It's not great. It's use of a bomb, but we could get money out of it. Okay, these fires will shoot at us, so we've got to be careful. Okay, we've, we've, we've successfully trapped ourselves here. This is real, real great. Do, the, do these fires dissipate at all? I don't believe they do. This is great. What the hell am I meant to do here? I don't even have a bomb to try and extinguish them, even if I could. I don't even know if that'll work. There's only two enemies left, but, like, what the hell do I even do here? Like, I've been hit. Doesn't matter then. That was, that was a lot of fun. I like losing my angel deal that way. That's, that's how, that's exactly how I was looking to lose my angel deal. Oh my god, I would have lost it there anyways. That's so fine. I guess. Nice, we got exactly 50 coins, which means we get max money here. Two of diamonds. Awesome. And then, I think we'll take this with us, which, actually, to be fair, we're not going Devil Deal, so I don't really see the point in taking that with us. Still a little bit scared on my HP. Let's just pretend it's all fine. I'm glad that we've got, what's it called now, though? Um, Mad Onion. So that means potentially a lot more damage for us. Basically, 5% chance to fire a shot that has no effects on it, which we don't have anyways, and does a lot more damage. Because we've got high fire rate, that 5% chance is going to happen even more often. Good. Give us some deep pockets, maybe. That'd be pretty good. Things are dying quick. Got some health back there. Give us the angel deal on the low chance. Okay, that calm minded like literally nothing to this dude. We got it there, and sadly, we did not get what we wanted. Right, let us go. Let us go. We got another world card to pop though, which is really nice. Hopefully, this time we can get our angel deal because we're trying to do mega Satan at the minute. Things aren't going so well on that front because 
We do not have um, any angel deals done. It's not looking super hurtful for me either. Interesting room there. Don't you dare get me poop slick. I'll be distraught. Don't have a thingy for that, a bomb for that secret room, sadly. This is going to be very, very frustrating with the slideys. Really don't want to be getting the the, uh, the loose brain guy until later on. Dude, this is... Oh, yeah, this is so frustrating. I'm having such a hard time lining up to kill these guys. Okay, luckily I left this guy to last because he can actually do some real damage with the creep that he puts down. Luckily we killed him pretty quick. Good. I will check out the shop. Why do I bother? I was like, ooh, I could get a soul heart in here. No, I could lose my angel deal in here. I'm, I'm so fucked. This guy's definitely... Dude, you can't just spawn more. This is tragic. I hate it when the goddamn game does this. Two greeds in a row. I just want to buy a goddamn soul heart. Is that so hard to ask? Is that so hard to ask? Apparently so. Also, this room is going to be fucking hell. The slippies almost made me run right into that guy. I'm so stressed right now. Stop with the sliding, you stupid piece. Not what we're looking for right now, but I will use it at least once. Uh, we're not going to get a soul heart before we get hit, are we? I'd like to think it could happen for us, but I'm thinking it's less and less likely at the moment. Let's go back and get our secret room real quick. See if that has any bearing. I'm giving us a soul heart. There's a there's a, there's a small chance. It does not. It also has you as well, hello. I would have liked to have gotten that uh, trinket, but I was not quick enough to react. And we can't buy a bomb because the shop is useless once again. God damn, so annoying. Good. Give me a soul heart drop, please. I don't know if morbid hearts count against devil deals, actually. I'm guessing they don't, but it'd be nice if they did. Sorry, the other way around. I'm guessing they do count against devil deals, but it'd be nice if they didn't. That was really close. The poop slick got me again. Just, it just happens. Like, I don't, I don't actually mind it. As an item, it's a it's a good idea, but it just happens way too fucking often. I'm just sliding around like 90% of the time. It does not feel just. Get away from me! Get away from me while I kill this goddamn spider. You little bitch. Really, we get Reap Creep. Reap Creep is not the sort of boss that we want to get, especially not when we're sliding around. We're not going to be able to dodge this guy for shit. Told you, not going to be able to dodge this guy for shit. Fuck this item in the ass. This is one of the worst items to ever be conceived. 
fuck this item so hard. Stupid, slippy bullshit. Give me a goddamn soul heart. Oh my god, game. How difficult is that? I mean, really, really peeved. But both my shops are jack shit. Oh, I'm just, I'm annoyed. This is such a good run, but I'm not going to be able to do my angel deal because the game just won't, won't play a ball. I might have to try and do a sacrifice room, but I've not even got the hearts to do that really. So even if I wanted to, am I going to be able to? Probably not. It don't matter what I want. Game won't give us any bombs. Game won't give us any soul hearts. It's just like, come on now. I mean, I know I've got good money and stuff, but the game won't even give us any shops. Even if we wanted to spend our money, it's like, ah, ha, ha, greed. Oh, look, it's greed again. Hmm. So funny. Such good design. Get out of here, greed. You're annoying the hell out of me. Oh. The slippy bullshit got me again. And I didn't have a soul heart once again, baby. Having soul hearts is a myth. I want to kill myself. <laughs> I'm so frustrated. I'm so frustrated. This run is so good. And the game just won't let... I don't even care about the angel items. Fuck off the angel items. I just want the goddamn key pieces. And keep your goddamn items. Just give me the goddamn key pieces. What the hell kind of shot was that? Right. Keep it moving. Plum flute? Dude, what the fuck's with all the actives as well? Go away. If you have an active already, item room should not be able to have an active. I don't want a new active. Go away. Watch the shop not even have a soul heart. What are the chances? I'm going to take this because it gives me half a soul heart per floor. I think that's valuable. Even though we're losing some damage. Oh, the poop slick's going to be horrible here. So many of the hands, what the hell? Keep it moving. Of course there's a golden penny in some way inaccessible. Love to laugh at me, don't you, game? Yeah, we're good. We're good. I say we're good. By that I mean I'm still angry. But I'm making the most of it. Stop planting fucking corn mines every six seconds. I don't care about the goddamn corn mines. I just wanted the damage up. All I goddamn wanted was the damage up. Did you have to play me dirty like this? Rude as hell. Right, I'm focusing hard here. We've got so many levels of fire rate right now. Come on. What are you doing? What are you doing? There you go. We got an angel deal, baby. I'm going to wait for these coins to explode because I'm scared. Um, I guess we'll take the Polaroid. And... Grant's Flight. I have to take it. Pascal Candle, you are great, but this completely nullifies the slippy bullshit we've been dealing with. And I need that in my life right now.
Holy hell, baby. Holy hell. We got flight, baby. We got flight. Pascal Candle would have been fun, though, for the fire rate, but goddamn. The fact that we got flight now makes our life infinitely easier. What exactly are you doing, good sir? Here you go. Die. This is a, a room I'm not a fan of. I'm going to put my fire rate up here. Okay. Just about getting through. We've got to get another angel deal yet if we want to make it. So we still got a ways to go. And we've only got a 21% chance, so... Not super likely either. This is a rough room, this. You are dead. Just a little Bebski left and a few of these. Good. Good, good. Don't really know where I'm meant to be going here, but I'm just hoping for the best. These guys actually aren't so bad. Really, that didn't kill you? God damn it. There you go. Got you. Oh god, these bouncy discs are scaring me. I love how rooms like this with flight. Easy breezy. Don't care about that bomb. Leave me alone. Just let me leave and give him my angel deal, please. You're firing out kids. Take out care of the real enemy first, then we'll take care of the kids. Another one? Fuck you. You can't just keep spawning them. I'll take this bomb, it's closer to me. Oh god. Scary, scary, scary. Womb is just a scary floor, it gets real intense. We're at 99 coins again, lovely. So we found our boss. Don't particularly like Big Boy here. Okay, good. Skolex. Try and take care of the side sideline guys first, if plausible. Now, is he going to be killable this time? Because I've had him before and not be killable. It seems to have been fixed, but... I don't really know. That seems to do a good amount of damage. Okay, his body is breaking up. I can see the, the, the skin peeling. We are doing damage as well now. Good, good, good. Holy shit, he's just tears everywhere. God damn. He's a much harder boss now, but a much more interesting boss than he used to be. Lovely rework. Yeah, we got him. Sadly, no angel deal here. Tears up. HP up. Shot speed up. Okay. Let us go. A good item, but we'd be losing a lot of damage to potentially get that, so... I don't think I wanna. Dude, who thought a small version of these guys would be fun? I'm baffled by the choices that are made by some developers. Bouncy eyeballs, no problem for me. 
Do I have Spectral now as well? No, there was just no rock there. Oh, what the fuck was I meant to do there? Walked in and got bopped straight away. Good. Hopefully right is the right way. So far we are looking good in terms of going the right way. Good. The hearts need to go straight away. They get evil. Okay, good. I'm going to use a bomb on you. Dude, that was a pretty good, that was a pretty good little tactic there. Tried to use a bomb on him, and he just fucking booped it away. I can't goddamn hit this guy because of his stupid eyes. Get out of here with them. Oh my god, we just straight up went the right way. I'm about to lose my angel deal, though I didn't realise. I'm one hit off losing it. Oh no. Okay. Do what we can here. Do what we can. Get an angel deal. Hell yes, we got the angel deal, baby. And we got crown of light out of it as well. Holy shit. Okay. This was all a bit scary, but we did it. We got our we got our key. I think we're ready for Mega Certain now. Wow. It's been a struggle bus. But we've made it. And yeah, Crown of Light here is obscenely good. Dude, this is really fucking annoying, guy. The fact that you have a little dude stuck to you is not what I want to see. Angel item or soul heart? Angel item. Spirit of acceptance. A little bit late for it, but it's pretty good. Oh, it did give us another item. Nice. Mysterious liquid. Yeah. Uh... We are gonna wreck now. Oh yeah, hopefully this means that on the actual boss fight before Mega Satan on the last floor, we can get quite a few more items. Because the spirit of acceptance, basically we pick up an item, there's a 50% chance that we just get another item. It's great. Get out of here, big earth. Keep it moving. Yeah, damage is now sky high, it's great. I'm so glad that we managed to solve our poop slick issue. Could have been a real problem for me. You know what? I think this is the right way. I'm going to take a risk. Do not like this. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Yeah, no, this is bullshit. What the fuck? Nah. Nah, 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 nah. Not entertaining this crap. Yeah, this is also really fucking annoying. Not entertaining this crap. Stop hitting me, please. Oh, these guys are herming like crazy. They also have a lot of fucking HP, apparently. Holy shit. Die, my dude, die. We would have had a sacrifice room here if we would have needed it, but we're good. Ah, there is great. Wait, what? You still deal damage even though the room's not active. Great. Didn't expect that for some reason. Probably should have done. And now we don't have Crown of Light active anymore because of that. Great stuff. I'm gonna I'm gonna go and try and get Crown of Light reactivated. Oh god, the frustration is building. It's building people. Okay, thank god. Crown of Light's back. 
Crown Erlite is back. For how long, we don't know, but we'll see. We do have Sawmills level tiers at the minute, so we should kill this guy relatively quickly. There you go, we got him. Right, down we go. It'd be nice to have some protection for our Crown of Light, but... I heard is what it is. Two doubled items, big fan. Book of Secrets, which is actually kind of useful here to find secret rooms. BBF, not great. Sister Maggie, fine. Eternal D12, bad. And Mum's Razor, okay. No thank you for the full run reroll. I will skip, skip that if that's okay with you. Hey, another soul heart. I'm just looking. I only got two luck, but if I get chests, that's more items, plus uh, the acceptance thing might give me even more items. So it's kind of worth us doing some extra rooms to try and get some of them. Boom, bow. $3 bill. I like it. Can be a bit risky at times, but I like it. What the fuck was that? Dude, this this little goober, it's an annoying combination of enemies right there. You got a golden something or other. Um, ooh, isn't the superiority extra damage versus regular enemies? Almond milk. Okay. Okay, almond milk. I will take your 22 fire rate. I'm not going to say it's exactly what I wanted, but... It's fine. Stop moving, dude. The room's so big. I'm going to need a lot more chests for me to feel okay about what's going on here. I'm not even quite sure what hit me there, but something did. There's another one of you guys still, okay. More items, please. We really can't be getting hit as well, because we lose so much damage when we get hit. Not really sure what to think of a room like this. But it's done now. Puzzle piece. Last puzzle piece. Puzzle piece. Spider mod. Not what I was expecting, but hey her. What the fuck hit me then? Squeeze me. Oh, god damn it. We've lost our goddamn thing now. Now I'm really angry. Okay, this has become a crap run now. <laughs> I'm in milk, why how could you? What the fuck is going on back there? What the fuck am I meant to do about all this bullshit? Also, apparently I have... Oh, it's um thingy, $3 bills messing with my tears. Not enough items at all here, game. Not enough red health either. None of these are items, really. Gonna give me these guys as well. Ugh. Open your fucking gobs. Dude, this is racism. I have two whole look. Where are my item rooms? Item rooms, item chests. You know what I meant. Where art thou? Soul heart's good. I like that. Ah, 
Okay. What the hell? BFF, whatever you're called. You just exploded and hit me, you little bastard. You little shit. 120 volt. Probably not worth the damage we just lost, but hey, her. Oh, we got a bit unlucky here, I think. We do have a room left with a second secret room attached, so go check that out. Teller pills. If you guys see error room, does it let you loop? I could teller pills try and get error room, then loop the floor. What? Fucking... Oh, BBF, you little fat cunt. BBF just cost me my goddamn crown of likes. He decided, ooh, it'd be fun if I exploded right at the door. No, you should be like Bob's brain and not be able to explode right at the fucking doorway, you tramp. You absolute psychopath. Get off my back. Just lost half of our damage because of you, you sack of shit. I got hit again, so even if this guy drops me a heart, I still don't get it back. He didn't, but... Ooh, this could be fun. This could be fun. I'm kind of tempted to do a full run reroll at this point. I might take in the full run reroll with me in case I get to low health and I can just pop it in a Hail Mary. Nothing from any of these rooms. Saddening. Right. Let's grab this then. We'll take it in with us. And we're just gonna hope for the best here. Very annoyed to not be going with my crown of light active. That's a kick in the balls, that is. This is going to be a slow fight. Thank you, Almond Milk. I think I'm at max fire right now. This is going to be a slow fucking fight. Holy shit. Oh no, I'm not max fire right You know what? I'm doing it. I'm hoping for the best. Getting hit by all sorts of bullshit. Don't even know what's happening. Okay, we're probably dead. Oh, the poop slick is still here, though. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? I didn't get flight and I've still got the brownie pissing me off. That's great. That's like the, one of the main things I was trying to get the fuck rid of. But still, it's here mocking me. Nope, doesn't matter. The poop slick killed me. After all that, wow, what a crappy load of crap that was. Right at the end, it screws me over with almond milk and get me hit. Ah, oh, the fucking BBF bullshit as well. Ah, oh, that was a frustrating run. Hope you guys enjoyed anyways. I'll see you guys in the next one.